From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hey there, Katie Homa in Trent with your News 5 update and Trent kicks things off with the forecast. Yeah, no, it's warm. We're actually talking about a pretty uh, okay first half of the day. It's the second half of the day. Things are going to get pretty uh, uh, pretty messy. Got a lot of rain coming our way. Temperatures, though, they're soaring first half of the day. We're back to near 54 degrees for a high, but once we get into those 50s, 1, 2, 3, 4 o'clock, we're going to be talking about rain rolling through. And at times, it could be some heavy rain. So just know as you're out and about trying to, you know, get outside practicing your social distancing and just trying to enjoy some of this warmth, it's eventually going to get pretty wet through the day today. We'll keep you up to date. The Cleveland Clinic will start testing people for the new coronavirus again today, but there are some changes as to who qualifies. The clinic has already tested more than 2,000 patients, and because of the high demand, it will now only test people who are at least 61 years or older or considered high risk at the W.O. Walker building. Those patients still need a doctor's order from the clinic. Anyone else who has the order has to wait for the clinic to contact them before showing up for the test. Cleveland State says it is postponing commencement. The school is also moving to remote learning for the rest of the semester. All students are ordered to be out of the dorms by Sunday. And here's what's happening today. Cuyahoga County Board of Health will provide an update on the novel coronavirus. We'll also hear from our governor this afternoon. Ohio's cases now stand at 67 across 16 counties. More than 300 people are under health supervision. Make sure you check back later today for another update. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.